As a butterfly lover, we've known, like we have a whole community and we've known that the population has been dwindling. And now the whole world knows monarch butterflies are now an endangered species, but there is something you can do to save them. Our Polk County Bureau reporter Stacy De Silva is joining us live from Lakeland City Hall, and that's where a lot of butterflies just love to hang out. Stacy. Yeah, Keith, and this is pretty unassuming. You can't really tell when you look at it, but this is a butterfly garden. It's one of several on city properties around Lakeland, and there are more in the works. It's to protect that beloved but endangered species, the monarch butterfly. At Lakeland's Common Ground Park. Oh, there's Firecracker. Everywhere you look. I know that that's going to be butterfly friendly because it's got the flowers on it. There are plants in the monarch butterflies that love them. Some people want, want to know exactly where the butterfly garden is. And the truth is, and this is really where home gardeners can get excited, is it doesn't have to be one spot. Beth Sherling with Lakeland Parks and Recreation says the city is adding even more butterfly gardens, including outside the Coleman Bush building. In May, two months before the endangered species announcement, the city made the mayor's monarch pledge day proclamation to, quote, save the monarch butterfly. It calls on residents to plant native milkweed at their homes. If you just have a pot on like a back porch or something, like anything we can do. Fifth grade science teacher Susan Wools has more than just a pot on the back porch. This is my butterfly garden. She cares for monarchs from the caterpillar stage through when they take flight. According to the International Union for Conservation of Nature, some North American monarch populations have dwindled by as much as 99.9%. We're glad that it's getting national attention now, and hopefully it will inspire more people to plant milkweed, native milkweed, to save the monarchs. The milkweed is so critical after an overwhelming response, though the city has stopped offering free milkweed plants to residents, but you can email them if you want to get on a list. If you do want to buy milkweed, make sure that they're native milkweed plants not tropical, that's bad. Reporting live in Lakeland, I'm Stacy De Silva, eight on your side.